today is the day. We are 10 minutes away from our clinic and we are gonna, in about half an hour or so, put our two little babies back in where they belong. They're coming home. <laughs> I'm coming home. So we're super excited and completely nervous. This morning at 8.30 or so, the, they called and I was convinced that the babies didn't make it and that we weren't even gonna get to do the procedure and I was ready to throw up, literally. And Josue called them back for me <laughs> and confirmed that everything was fine. We just needed to sign a piece of paper. So I'm glad. That was That's one hurdle already, just knowing that they have thawed and that they're ready to go. So we're excited, nervous, all that all that good stuff. Same thing, but we're almost there and eight years of waiting has come down to this moment. So, so it's crazy. We're excited. If I sound weird, it's because I'm sick. I mean, I'm like the last part of it. I'm pretty sure it's out of my system, but I still have a little leftover. Well, congestion. Mucus. Congestion. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you in there. This is the view. Giant Christmas tree. And giant bear. <laughs> so this is my fancy hydro glass. I drank the whole thing in the last 30 minutes, so I'm about to drink another bottle of water because you have to have a super full bladder for them to do this, so that's gonna be real fun. I'm real excited. <laughs> but at least it's Christmas time! So he gets to go into, and so he has to wear his hairnet. Looks so good. And his little sock booties. And then I'm about to get dressed too. I have to, uh, a little bit more. <laughs> my gown, my hair, my sock booties. But I also brought these really fun extra long socks because that's a thing in the IVF world to wear cute socks on your transfer day. And they say that keeping your feet warm keeps your uterus warm. You, you snapping me while I record you? Yes. Okay, I gotta get dressed before they... So, we're getting ready here, as you can see. I'm going in too. Alright, here's the beauty with her beautiful gown on. Getting her socks to keep her feet warm. Warm and toasty. What kind of socks are those? They're little bears. Aww. And they're knee highs. They're a little tight, so they can't quite pull them all the way up. So they're more like little warmers. I don't have petite little legs. So that's the best size I can get them. They're fuzzy though. I'm getting fuzzes everywhere though. That's a good thing or a bad thing. Um, How are you feeling right now? I don't even know. Like, I'm just going with the flow because if I overthink about it, then I'm going to get nervous. But I'm excited mostly that this is actually happening, but it still feels surreal. So. All right, let's see you throw that beautiful hair net on. Tip my little hairs in there. <clears throat> Very good. You are ready. Is it on? It's on. So I get work done over there. No. <laughs> I'm still drinking water. My bladder feels almost full, but not quite there. I think I need a little bit more. But I'm starting to feel nauseous from just chugging so much water. <laughs> so I gotta slow it down a little bit. Slow it down a little bit. It's like my little bear socks. Let's say you like my bear socks.
How are you feeling? <laughs> How are you feeling? <laughs> Officially has two embryos. <laughs> That's just crazy. <laughs> Hopefully, they'll become babies, okay. or at least one baby. It's really hard to tell, but you see that little like white line? That's the tube. There's a little blob like over here, and that's where the two little babies are hanging out. How do you feel right now? That's what I keep saying. Hi. We're out on a family walk. There's my mom. She watched the babies. So we can make more babies. So we can make more babies. So we were told by the nurse there to not lay around because we need blood flow. So we're getting our blood flowing. <laughs> That's my giant bladder because I drink so much water. Holy moly, you guys. <laughs> it make you fill your bladder up completely, and then they put all this pressure, like push, and you try not to pee your pants. I think I might have <laughs> trickled. I don't know. I don't want to know. <laughs> but no, seriously, that was probably the hardest part. The rest of the evening we feel so it's exciting.